Hello everyone, my name is James. Today I'm going to be answering a few questions which are what is a DAW, where and how is it used, what is its history, some major companies that are making DAWs, and interesting products that are on the market. So starting with the first question, what is a DAW? So a DAW is essentially a digital audio workplace which can be an electronic device or a piece of software which, which tends to be used by people to mix, record, edit, master, and even produce audio files. Now to answer the question where and how is it used. DAWs can be used almost anywhere such as recording studios, home studios, etc. However, it also depends on what kind of DAW you're using, whether it is a physical one or a software DAW. Since DAWs are generally used throughout software these days, I'll be explaining it through that. It's in the name itself, it's a workstation. You'll be creating tracks, basic recording, basic mixing, then practice recording your own music using what you have learned. Now for the question, what is its history? The first DAWs were conceived in the late 70s and early 80s. Soundstream, which developed the first digital recorder in 1977, developed what is considered the first DAW, bringing together a mini computer, disk drive, video display, and the software to run it all was the easy Now to answer the question, major companies that make DAWs. We have Ableton Live, Logic Pro, Studio One, Bit Bit uh, Bitwig Studio, Audacity, Pro Tools, GarageBand, Steinberg Cubase, FL Studio, and Reaper. Now for the question, interesting products that are related to DAWs that are on the market. You have the Behringer Touch X, which is essentially a mini physical DAW, and the Akai MPK Mini Player, both of which increase portability. But honestly are obsolete because DAWs are built into software and can be brought anywhere at any time. This brings an end to our video. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.